all my life I loved the state of Israel, but the butchery in Gaza is barbaric and unacceptable. Femi Faneta already says, see FFK don't tire for Nigerian politics, don't they enter uh, Middle East politics, talking about Israel and Hamas. Now what for this man who, eh? So the question is, the Hamas group of Palestine that went to start the fight by killing over 200 uh, uh, Israelis that were in a festival. What do you say about that? Because that is what is initiated or what started this uh, last war that are fighting now. It was the Hamas terrorists that started it and they killed over 200 Israelis during their festival. So, and now Israel is reacting and they call it butchery. The, I don't think uh, 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 FFK understand how this war started and what triggered this last fight that is going on right now. Yeah. But let's dive into the detail. But even, even at that, the killing in Gaza is still not up to the killing that has happened in Nigeria under the eight years of Buhari government where they were all eating and drinking, full and eats and uh, herdsmen, uh, bandits, Iswap and Boko Haram were busy killing people in the bush in Nigeria, including soldiers. Uh, so I'm sure if, that, if you had to take the death toll of Nigerians in the hand of terrorists, it's even more than what has happened in Gaza put together. Hmm? A former minister of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Femi Fanekaide, had described the ongoing massacre in Gaza as barbaric and unacceptable. In a long write-up on his official Twitter uh, account today, Fanekaide stated that all his life he loved the state of Israel, but his current action against the Palestinians in Gaza is condemnable and one of the most notorious example of mass inhumanity against his fellow humans. Hmm. He stated that no any sane person in the world can enjoy or derive satisfaction from the killings of innocent people in Gaza. Faneta Ade said the bombing of Gaza is a staged state-sponsored terror in the most primitive and savage form. He added that ethnic cleansing of the Palestinians is unconscionable un un and unjustifiable okay the butchery in gaza how can any sane person enjoy a or derive satisfaction from a slaughter that is not taking place in gaza okay it is indefensible it is unacceptable it is nothing but state-sponsored terror in its most savage and primitive form it is ethnic cleansing it is genocide it is mass murder it is wickedness it is barbaric it is evil it is the most notorious and graphic example of mass inhumanity to man it is unconscionable and it is unjustifiable he wrote in english they speak when soldiers were killing the eagles innocent people in all when soldiers under the nose of buhari and uh, Uzadima, and you were there as a minister or whatever they gave to you um, as an AD in the Buhari's government. What did people say? Nothing. Eh? Boko Haram were killing people, declaring people homeless in Borono State, in Benue, and Governor Tom was shouting, you were in the government with Buhari, what did you do? The killing in Plato State has not even stopped up till now. We were asked to declare a state of emergency so I can find a solution to it. Nothing happened. The soldiers, when the full enhancement entered through Ebony into Igbo land and started raping and killing women and killing people in their farms, the people rose up to fight and protect themselves. The government could not support them. What did you do? What did you say? You dispatched the soldiers to go and start killing the Igbo, both the IPOP, the ESN, and everybody in the name of uh, fighting against terrorism in the Southeast. What did you do? Look at Niger State, the, the terrorists have gained ground, owned almost eight local government areas in Niger State now, and now we have two governors in Niger State. What has the government done? Nothing. You are here talking. This man should go and pack well. Tell you the truth. Should go and pack well. So it's Israel owned that you are seeing. Now, when, is, when the Palestinians, Hamas, started that fight by killing over 200 Israelis during their festival, you didn't see anything because that was what agitated Israel to do what they're doing right now to make sure every standing uh, Hamas soldier is a dead man. That is exactly what they have declared. And you are saying that uh, 
so Israel are supposed to die, Abi. Instead of you to see what terrorists are doing and stop them, you are they started and initiated the whole trouble, and you cannot talk to them. They are coming to talk to Israel. Okay, now let's see how that will help because Israel is bent on finishing the assignment and they are determined to finish it now once and for all. All right, so some people are already reacting to what FFK said. Uh, somebody said, and the butchery by Hamas is not barbaric and it is unacceptable. Abi. That is the thing. And somebody said, good question. Uh, so you don't mind that man he's sick for brain uh, you think they are like nigerians that have been romancing boko haram and bandits for decades abby yes now and ffk has been on has been in Buhari's government that has been romancing the israel the boko haram and the and the and the fulani henchmen causing problem in nigeria because outbursts like this are not uh, completely surprising coming from a man who is giving up to emotionalism <laughs> and sensationalism. It also depicts the views of one who knows nothing about either the nature of the enemy Israel is fighting or the circumstances under which the Israel army is operating. In war, there will always be collateral damage, more so when Hamas is heavily using civilians as human shields as a strategy. To listen to views like this simply means to let Hamas off the hook, which would be suicidal on the part of Israel. Exactly. Exactly. As I say, was it not Hamas that started the war? Eh? Don't touch lion tail, whether dead or alive. More <laughs> than FFK, eh? your own too much. Uh, someone said, why didn't you go and support the Hamas over there instead of sitting in Nigeria here complaining? Eh? <laughs> Do you think Israel is like Nigeria compensating terrorists and granting them amnesty? Nonsense from Mr. F FFK. Only African Christians are supporting Israel terrorists. Who? Okay, not only Nigeria wants no peace for the wicked. They started it FFK, you may be fighting against God's will unknowingly. You pretend to be a Christian, but know nothing about God's ways with Israel. And if I may ask, I may ask you, do you realize that Hamas started this war? Do you realize that innocent Israelis are still held hostage by Hamas till now? Now, in your opinion, should the hostages not be rescued? Your controversies have gone beyond the shores of Nigeria. You are like the sea waves never stable bagam first go and join hamas don't stay here to make noise go and join hamas exactly go and join hamas eh so as he said my mind the man was left out in the asshole rock and since then has been speaking from both sides of his mouth not be smart you know Tinobu's government has not looked at his side at all the man has nothing yet it's a useless man don't carry your double tongue to go that side though ffk has a switch sickness <laughs> don't be surprised if he praises israel and conducts hamas tomorrow a true talk it could be true <laughs> but they killed 1400 israeli people just in a day but okay but nobody is talking about it now eh? know how to talk now eh? somebody say, who are you so to speak but who started the war actually? I didn't see any provocation that warranted bombing or invasion. Okay? Or sending airstrike to Tel Aviv. Exactly. It was Hamas that started the whole problem. So, what are you going to say about that? I will make FFK pack for one side. Nigeria and Oliver. Tinubu government has left him behind, so he doesn't know where to start from. So, thank you for listening and let's have a comment.